everybody. Welcome back. So, day seven? Yes, we've survived a whole week. Been here a week. Can y'all believe that? And we're not even tired of it yet. No, not at all. Yeah. I mean, there's some things I'm tired of, but <laughs> being here ain't one of them. <laughs> um, so, after, what, a three-day battle? Today's day three, yes. A three-day battle. Um, we finally got the drilling rig in, guys. That's where it's supposed to go. That is where it's supposed to go. He put it there on purpose. The tree is very close. It is leaning that way a little bit. So once he gets his outriggers out and gets it leveled out, it'll be away from that tree. But right on the other side of that tree is where our well is going to be drilled. Um, he is lined up perfectly with it right there where he's at. So finally... He is coming tomorrow to, to set the casing. Tomorrow to set the casing and supposed to finish the well on Sunday. But we're showing like a 70% chance of rain tomorrow. So we'll see. Yeah. I don't know if they'll want to do it if it's raining. But an unexpected expense. Expense. We had to put rock down, guys. We had to get him some rock so he can get in here. And he made it in. Absolutely perfect this time. The rock guy did an excellent job. Keep an eye out on a video um, over at Working with Wiley. I'm going to post a short video of the rock guy. I'm going to tell you something. If you're in this neighborhood and you need rock, call these guys. They are awesome. He done a Affordable, job. and he did a really good job. Yeah, done a really good job. Of course, it's the same guy who did uh, rock for Mike and Lissa. Yeah. Yeah. At DD5, yeah. so or Drifting Dreamers. So you probably five. already know, but I'm going to tell you again in a video on my channel. Yeah. i working with Wiley. That's our other channel. Yeah. Uh, let's see, what else did we have today? Oh, we're going to take you guys down to Jeff's and show you what we got done at Jeff's today. Yep, show you what we got done down there today. Um, and guys, I'm wore out. Um, Me too. We started back home a while ago and walking up the hill... I, I I was done. I was ready for Jen to carry me. I, I was I just was... going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got to say, my muscles are tired, too. They're not sore, thank goodness, but I am tired. Yeah. This has been... Oh, also, uh, one more one more thing oh, I forgot that okay. I got done today. Let's walk up here. I'll show you. Or, I didn't get done, but I got started. We'll put it that way. So, this is the driveway that's in already. This is obviously the van's parked here, drilling rig sitting down there. I started clearing out. This will be the driveway going up to where we're going to be building our home. So, it's a start, but I actually am able to drive up it. So It's a start in a very long process. Yeah. So, we actually, you can't really see it from here, but there's a flat spot up there. And we worked on that last summer. Uh, and then before we had decided where we wanted to build our house, we had cleared that spot and made it flat so that we could have a party there. And we figured that's going to be our staging area for all of our building materials and things like that. But at this point right now, it's just going to be a place to park our trailers. Right. And... Um, Eventually, this road will go up, and then it'll circle back because our house is going to face the northeast. So, this is the very beginning of the road that's going to go to the house. Yep. So, let's get you down to Jeff's and get you show you what we got done down there today. Oh, pause. So... Something really, really awesome happened for Jeff's house today. Yeah. And, um, but... A big, huge step. A big, huge step. Yeah. But you'll have to watch his video, Bobblehead Homestead, because it's not our place to tell you about that news. Wiley might have already given Although it Although I did let a little bit slip on my live today on my channel over yeah, at Working with Wiley. So, um, this channel is going to have more respect for our new neighbor <laughs> and not say that I'm, on here. So, I, just, I, 
I got a big mouth. I'm sorry. He does. I'm sorry, Jeff. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't think Wiley's good at keeping a secret. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm going to flip this around. Okay, tell us what else got done today. Why do I have to tell you? Because you're the one who did but it. you put me on the spot and I don't even know what to talk about. So, Jeff had um, all his chicken coops over here. And we all carried them and put them in the places all around the property that he wanted. There's one. There's one. Uh, there's one on the other side of Drew's backhoe. There's one behind the shed. There's one behind the shed. There's actually another one behind the shed over there in the trees. Let's go back there and talk yeah, about it really we'll quick. Go. All right, let's walk that way and talk about it. So, one other thing that I want to tell you guys about. We actually got to meet our neighbors today between us and Jeff. Right. They're a young couple, and they actually seem like a really respectable set of young people. Um, they're just out here trying to do kind of what we want to do. Yeah. And they also explained to us that they came from a place that they had a really hard time with their neighbors and so they were a little um standoffish maybe or right because they were afraid that they were gonna have bad neighbors again yeah. i totally get that I, so i totally understand uh but we i think we're all gonna get along just fine i think they're from, gonna fit in great yeah right yeah and um they seem like nice people and they were like well if y'all ever need anything just let us know and da 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 so yeah who knows um and we told them that uh we found out that they don't have water either so and our well is actually going to be closer to their house than our camp yeah and so we said hey if you guys want y'all can run a hose from our well and or whatever and uh we'll see so we'll see how that works out yep. <coughs> uh they've been used to living without water for a while i think i think they like just buy jugs of water in town or something that yep. But we can make their life a little bit easier. Yeah. If, you know. Sure wouldn't, enough. Wouldn't cost us anything extra to share. So, right. anywho. Uh, so, that's that. That's an update on that situation. Let's flip this back around so you can see what's going on. There's a chicken coop. And there's a chicken coop. And there's a f fire. Fire. <laughs> and then you can see there's more chicken coops back here in the woods. So now we've just got to get the fencing all set up around all. We'll get his electric fencing all set up around all these coops, and he will be ready for chickens, um, which is not a big deal. It's a it's a quick, easy job to put that fencing up. So I mean, right. he's basically ready for chickens. And if you know much about watching his channel, um. He's been waiting on fin plumbing to be finished and chickens to be moved so that he can move. And he is so, so, so close. So I expect, I don't know, I, you know, shouldn't estimate other people's timelines. But I think he'll be here within the next couple of weeks for as, sure. As long as the weather allows, I'm going to put my money on by the end of next week. Right. Yeah. But we are expecting some rain and... um. It's going to be hard for trailers to get into his current place, I think. Yep. If it's slippery. So, <laughs> I think that's all the updates we have for you guys today. Oh, Tomorrow... no, wait, one more. Oh. So, Lindsay actually run the backhoe pretty much all day today. Oh, yeah, she was kicking butt. Yeah, and she got all his hygge culture beds all packed in and everything pushed down and cleaned up and ready for topsoil. So, Sweet. Yeah. That's so awesome. I didn't even know that. Drew was out on the chainsaw cutting mm -hmm. all the stumps that was sticking up that she couldn't get packed down. And then she was packing them down with the backhoe. And yeah. So there it is, guys. I think that's about it for today. Lindsay, you rock. Yeah. yeah. Tomorrow, uh, we are going to take a day off. We might go to town and do some shopping and get some materials that we need. Uh, but that's probably going to be about it. We're tired and we want a day off. So... That's it. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Well, we thank you guys, everybody, for watching. We especially thank our members for supporting us. We love you guys, and we'll see you all on the next video.